It's Ash from Super Videos back for another video for season 11 of The Walking Dead. In this video, we're going to be talking about who will survive and who will die the series. So we're going to have our death predictions for part three of season 11, which is the final season. Now, I already did a version of this earlier, but I realized that there were a bunch of people that I missed. Thinking about it, some of the people I missed were actually important characters, so... I decided to completely do a new one. Now I did do a death predictions a while back for all parts of the season. Some of my death predictions were right, some were wrong, but since this is the final season, I thought it made sense to do an updated death predictions video, which is likely going to be the final death predictions that I'm going to do for the main show. So stay tuned, we'll be right back with my death predictions. <music> All right, as always, before we jump into this, smash that like button, subscribe to join our community, and press the bell to be notified when I upload on the channel. With that said, let's just dive right into it. Let's take care of the easy ones. So these are the characters that I think are definitely safe. Daryl, Carol, Maggie, and Negan. The reason for that is because they're getting their own spinoff. So unless that was a publicity stunt and a way to distract us, these four characters are definitely safe. Next up, we have the legacy characters, Gracie, Judith, RJ, and Herschel Jr. All of these characters also, I think, will make it. None of them are going to be at risk of dying. The one that I have at the top, if I have to choose one, if one is going to die, it'll probably be Gracie, but I doubt they're going to kill Gracie. But Judith, RJ, and Herschel Jr. are 100% safe. Next up, we have Magnus Group. Out of Magnus Group with five people, I think two are going to die. I think the people at risk of dying are Yumiko and Magna. Now, the reason why I have Yumiko is because some of her story is somewhat matching what they did with Dwight. So even though she did get a large part of Michonne's comic story, there is still a bit of story that she's been given in season 11 that sort of matches Dwight or maybe even Rick, depending on how you look at it. Magna, similar situation. She could either get Dwight or Rick's comic story. So because of that, I have her as one potential death. I think Connie, Kelly, and Luke are probably safe. Which is very interesting because you would think these would be the ones that are at most risk. The last group we have is this group right here. First, Virgil. Who cares, right? I think he's safe though because he has some sort of connection to Michonne or not connection, but connection to her final story. So they might have him live on after the series. Next is Jules, Luke's girlfriend. Again, who cares? right? But I think she's probably going to die from Jerry, Aaron, and Rosita. I think they're probably going to kill all three of them. Gabe and Ezekiel, I'm 50-50. I think there's a chance that they might kill none of them, but there's a chance they might kill one of them. So I'm 50-50. Elijah is probably going to die, and I think Lydia is probably safe. So just to squeeze that list down to five main deaths that I think we're gonna see, I think it'll be Rosita, Aaron, Jerry, one of Ezekiel and Gabriel, and one of Yumiko and Magna. And that's pretty much my death predictions. I hope you enjoyed this. Share your thoughts and opinions and predictions in the comment section below. If you enjoyed this video, smash that like button, subscribe to join our community, and press the bell to be notified when I upload on the channel. That's it for this video. See you next time for another super video.